Dr. Samuel Odong Oledo's leadership troubles started when he led a team of medical students and interns to a youth function on 3rd December, where he opened the campaign for President Museveni to consider running for the presidency again in 2026. This was met with a critical backlash from the Uganda Medical Association, with members calling for his resignation and censure. Yesterday, in an extraordinary assembly, the association voted Dr. Oledo out of office and consequently replaced him with his vice president, Dr. Edith Naku. And the third resolution was uh, a suspension of membership of Dr. Samuel Oledo from the association uh, for a period of, of four years. My number one job at this time is to bring back our organization to be aligned with its objectives and goals and to bring the people together. We've been wounded, so we need healing, we need to come back together, we need to stick together and strengthen the organization. However, Dr. Oledo has since denied committing any professional misconduct before moving to court to stop his censure. In his application before court, Dr. Oledo accuses his colleagues in the Medical Association of Bias and acting irrationally in removing him from office. Dr. Oledo also contends that unless court intervenes, he is likely to suffer an injustice. We want everything or every business of the Uganda Medical Association, for starters, for now, to stay put, to stand, all right, that nothing should be done, no decisions should be taken. However, the Uganda Medical Association has told court that Dr. Oledo's application has already been overtaken by events as he has already been suspended from the association's membership for four years. The association wants court to dismiss Dr. Oledo's petition with costs as he was aware of the events that led to his dismissal. So we will wait uh, the decision of the court in the temporary injunction which will be delivered on Thursday and then uh, we shall get further guidance from the court to hear whether to proceed with uh, the hearing of the miscellaneous cause of judicial review or not. But the interim injunction has also drawn mixed reactions from both parties, with Dr. Oledo claiming that it instantly gives him back his office. Justice served, is justice never denied. I'm still the president of Uganda Medical Association. Uh, we are returning to the status quo as it was when Dr. Oledo was still the president. So ideally, uh, the decisions that were taken yesterday um, that were of the effect that, he, uh, that uh, the vice president has become the president in the interim, etc., etc., all those things have been reversed by court in the interim. The association insists Dr. Naku is now association president. court also issued uh, an interim injunction stopping any activity in regards to uh, Uganda Medical Association as it was by the time court delivered that ruling. In other words, the status quo is that uh, the former vice president, who is now the president, Dr. Naku, Judith, is the current president. Both parties are now expected to await court's ruling, which is due on Thursday. Joyce Nagato, NTV, tonight.